First of all, you have to remove the seat, unscrewing the seat retaining bolt with a Phillips screwdriver. Move the seat towards the rear of the motorcycle, so the seat disengages from the frame tab. Undo the 7 16th bolt that keep the battery strapped to the frame. Remove the battery strap, unhooking it from the frame. Remove the battery top cover. Disconnect the negative battery cable first from the battery with a 10mm spanner. Remove the positive battery cable bolt. Now we can remove the battery. Inspect the battery tray and cushion for contamination or damage and clean it. This is a new aftermarket battery. In this case you must insert the treated copper pins inside the terminals to allow the screwing of the new bolts. Place the spacer provided with the bolt inside the positive cable terminal and apply some blue thread locker on the bolt. Place the new battery and keep the board and the spacer on positive cable terminal. Tighten the bolt securely. It's helpful to use a long Phillips screwdriver reaching the bolt from the other side of the motorcycle frame. Apply some blue thread locker on the other bolt and screw it with the spacer to connect the negative cable terminal. Tighten the bolt with a 10mm spanner. Now you can check if the new battery is working fine. Place a protection cap on the positive battery terminal. Place the top cover. Attach the forward end of the battery strap under the front side of the battery tray. Then lay the strap over and into the groove in the battery top. Insert the trigger stud on the rear end of the battery strap into the hole at the rear side of the battery tray. Install the washer and the nut. Tighten the nut securely with the 716 spanner.
place the seat. Move the seat towards the front of the motorcycle so the seat engages in the front tab. Screw the seat retaining board with the Philips screw driver. Click on thumb up if you like my video and subscribe to my channel.